A former high school football star charged with rape went on national television today to say he's innocent. Matt Bishop and his parents appeared together on the Dr. Phil show. Bishop says he did not sexually attack his classmates. News 13's Kimberly King is live in Henderson County. Kim, what impact could this have on the case? Larry, if Matt Bishop's testimony to Dr. Phil has any inconsistencies compared to what he originally told police, it could have a huge impact if and when this case ever goes to trial. 17-year-old Matthew Bishop made his appearance on national TV today telling Dr. Phil he's innocent, saying, I had consensual sex with a girl. She was conscious. She took me downstairs. She started to unbutton my pants, and then that's when we started having sex. Bishop told Dr. Phil it wasn't a gang rape, alleging the victim wanted sex with each of the boys. As for drinking heavily, Bishop said, that was really stupid of me to put myself in a situation like that, and I really regretted that. That kind of behavior, unfortunately, is going to come with some penalties. The alleged victim also went on the show saying she was raped. One of them was carrying me upstairs and put me on Matt's lap. And they were unbuckling my pants and shirt, and I told them I was going to go downstairs. I ended up on the ground. They kind of started taking off my clothes again. I don't remember initiating anything. The alleged victim admitted she'd had past relations with Bishop, saying their relationship was basically just a sexual one. And and that the two had sex previously three times. The victim said she came to the party because she had a crush on Tyler Guerin, also charged. But she said Guerin planned to have sex with another girl. The alleged victim told Dr. Phil, I was there for Tyler. I was pissed, and that was the only reason I started drinking. In Hendersonville, opinions on the case are wide open. I think that uh, it could destroy the rest of their lives for poor decisions that they made. So whether or not it was consensual or not, as a parent, if you don't uh, if you don't have a parent there to, to uh, kind of direct them, be a part of their life, be a part of what's going on in the. The case has had a number of pre-trial continuances. Currently, there is no trial date set. This show today was part one of a two-part special that Dr. Phil is doing on the case. The second one will air tomorrow. Reporting live at East Henderson High School, Kimberly King, News 13.